Hi, it's Hazy, and welcome to my channel. So my voice is still bad, yeah. <laughs> so, um, so what I'm doing today is messing about with brushos. Brushos are powdered paints or something. Colour craft brusho. <laughs> so uh, they're powdered, and they've got a little. Um, I think they're made up different colours, so you can get sort of different colours. I do. This is brusho. See all that effect there. Not nothing special on it at all, apart from just water. And um, so I'm creating things with that. Showing you what you can make. You don't have to make these things, but you could do other things as well. I adore this. This looks so nice. The pocket. Or tuck. That would look gorgeous in a journal. And then you could perhaps even put... Where are my other things I've done? Oh, I've got them all in a bag somewhere. But where is that? Where is it? I've got a few that I've cut out from the previous one. Can you imagine that? And then you've got things like this as well. On the page, Ooh, I think that'd be nice. Just thought of that just now. A couple of flowers there. Look, green flower, yay! <laughs> As well, yeah, that'd be nice. Things like that on the page, yeah. So, if you hope you join me today. Please uh, give me a thumbs up. Please share my video. Press the notification bell with your crafty fingers. And what's the other one I do? <laughs> oh, uh, I've done them all. Subscribe to my channel. I've said that. Yay! Thank you so much. That's how you support me for free. Thank you. And. um what else can I tell you? Uh, please join my Facebook group, Hazy Crazy Art. The reason is, uh, I've got printables on there. Hopefully I've got this. I do, I do actually use this in this video. So, things like that on there. If, not, if I haven't, I can put it on there. I think I, should, I, think I have. So I'll push it on it. <laughs> right, or pen or something. Right, and um, there we go. So, I hope, we, hope you enjoy. Hope you enjoy. I hope you join me today. I'm trying to say, I'm just getting attacked by the glue and everything else out of the focus over here. Uh, you can't really see me over <laughs> in this corner. There was just my glue was attaching to my cardi. Okay then, let's go. Okay, so today today we are concentrate concentrating, experimenting even with some colour. You. So what I've got is I've got some brusho uh, paints. Okay, brusho colour craft. That one's lemon. Yeah, they're really nice. It's got little holes in. I haven't got the lids. The lids. The little pins, because I was watching Louise, Louisa Heinzer and she had uh, little pins in hers. But I'm going to put some colours on. Ooh, yeah, the reason I'm doing this is because obviously I've got a bad, bad voice. <laughs> bad voice, I'm putting a couple of these on. And I did this uh, the other day, and what I did was let it dry. And then, um, so this is little powders. Yeah, yeah. I did used to pick them out like this, so you don't do this. Oh, that's loads in there, look. And you, uh, I'd get pinches on, but you do get a lot. I saw Louise had put a little hole in theirs. But she's got pins in. Hold on a minute. That does not seem to be coming out. The hole seems to have closed up. I think the idea is the pin actually will actually. <laughs> those mat, You know those matte pins uh, you get? She put those in there. You might have seen it. Oh, let's have some brown. Right. I'm going to have some. It's ever such a lot of fun. I've been having, making sure we've got a proper hole in these things. Well, I'll tell you which one I do like, are these? Now, which one is it? There's one called, um, no, it's none of that. It's maybe the one I look at, like, I think it's, is it leaf green? Yeah, look, it comes, like you see, it looks, it comes out orange. You think to yourself, why is that leaf green? <laughs> leaf green, they've got it wrong. No, they haven't. It comes out, let me put water on it, and now this is magic, I love doing this. I was messing about with it yesterday, I thought I'd have to do that on video, yay, when that's because I'm ill. Yeah, look, can you see that? That's amazing, isn't it? Yay. It just amazingly comes to life at your, your page. Yeah. So, what you can do with it, I, I'll tell you in a bit, because I'm going to do it in two, well, I'm going to do this first, <clears throat> and I'm going to do, there's a, there it is, not all the green on that side, yay. Green's one of my favourite colours in a journal, even though it's not, I, I, I love green at the moment, but, uh, some reason. Look, oops, where's my thing that I had yesterday? My thing was oh, here. There it is. <laughs> I did that yesterday. I thought that was a, it's a kitchen roll, and you can absorb it if you like. And um, it won't get any, it won't. Uh, oh yeah, you've got to be careful with this because it might um, stain your surfaces. Apparently, so this is one we need to actually protect our desk. 
Look, there's me, there's me, look, getting carried away again. Oh, get off, get off. Getting it all over my clothes. Don't matter about these clothes because they're old. Stuff I wear inside or taking the dog for a walk, stuff like that. No, the jumper I wear outside, but trousers and t-shirt. It's inside stuff. Right, so we can you can do things like that. You can also add to it. Now, I haven't got any blue on there, so I might want a bit of blue. Let's see what we got. Orange, black. Black be nice. I, I'm all green. Scott, where's all the blues? Turquoise, there you go. There's a sort of bluish colour. I have to get some map pins. I did have some, and I thought, what can I... This is about 20 years ago. What could I use these map pins for? I've got them. They look pretty. What do I, yeah, and of course, about 20 years later, I've got an idea. <laughs> That's what I wanted them for. Oh, yeah, I've had these. I've had these a while. I've had these ages. Now, watch this now. Yay! See, yay! <laughs> it's magic. Brilliant. Yay! Yeah, brush show's fun. Yeah, little. Pa I've also got besides brush show ones. I've got these magical. Pop, that's pop rock purple apparently but you do undo these you can't really make a hole in the top of these and um you put these in as well so you can put them in when it's wet as well you don't have to have dry paper you can put them in when it's wet you fun second so although i had a bad light, night last night with my asthma which i could not control at all i feel a lot better today all right there we go see so got nice blues on it now see mm -hmm. oh look at that. i like the way that's done that that purple oh wow and it's really sort of grungy muted colors as well though, about that that's what we like and what have i forgotten to do still not protected my table hold on right so i got me and i'm thinking about right this is lined paper so i think if i get that way i can still put this on the back of um uh, journaling cards and things and things i want lines on hee <laughs> so that'd be fun right so what i've done is that's a lot yeah the back's got a little bit on as well so I'm going to leave this. I don't think that needs a bit more water on it because it's still got that. Ah, it's still got that powder on it. Wait a minute. Even though it made that pretty colour, let's see what it'll do when I put more water on that purple. Yeah, not so good. I don't know if it's as good as the. Let me go and get some fresh kitchen towel. Right, I've just realised I haven't shown you, but that's what I get back. And that purple isn't actually coming up so well. Oh, it's weird. It shows on here, but it's not. Okay, well, another thing is protect your fingers if you don't want. Um, I mean, I'm not bothered. <laughs> I do, I do crafts. <laughs> but if you don't, if you're going out anywhere and you think, oh no, I don't want my fingers that colour, <laughs> you uh, need to protect your hands, perhaps with gloves or something. There we go. I think that's all do. That's all do. That's all do. <laughs> there we go. That's all do. Right. Oh no, it's not even coming off the thing. I should have done that first lot. Never mind, it doesn't really matter. We're not gonna, we're not going to. Um, we're just gonna have a really ragged page, and that might be good in a way, eh? There we go. <clears throat> yeah, okay, so that's there a lot, but we're not bothered about that, are we? I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna tear this one off first. Okay. This is a dictionary page, just book page. I haven't got any brown book pages, like some people have, and really pretty brown ones or caramel ones. Just got these white ones. This is why I sometimes print out <laughs> when I want something, you know, to look different. Anyway, right then, should we do it again? Right, you can either do it, you can either spray it on first, or you can but I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it in a pattern, I think. So I'm gonna try and have um Possibly circles. I can't really show you what I've done because that, that's a surprise at the end. But I did it upside down anyway. Right, this is. Um, I'm going to sh show you later what I'm going to do. Okay. Right. So let's have let's have similar to what I did. Right, turquoise and green. Turquoise. <laughs> I mean, it, it does actually um, nearly spit then, which is uh, not a bad thing. It just made the page. <laughs> it probably would actually work, but you don't want to do that really, do you? Right. Right, let's see, put that a bit there, look. So I've got that there, and it's sort of a circle thing. Let's see if I can get it. I bet I can't get in a circle. Oh, look at that. So that's uh, turquoise and sea green. I'm going to try one of the other colours I've got, actually, as well. <clears throat> one of these. Um, that's green. Oh, that's green. Well, that, that looks actually yellow, but that is green, apparently. It's very good. This is why it's made up of different, and it's really exciting when it changes colour. I'm going to put a bit of that on there. Yeah, you've got to look, it's getting everywhere. This is why this is why it's a really good idea. So I'm glad I watched Louise. 
she sh I thought, what's she got there? She's got like little um, holes in hers. <laughs> of course, I was using my fingers and I think it's a brilliant idea. Hold on, hold on, come on. All right, I don't know if this one's trying to get on the phone too, but he's obviously trying to get on the phone to somebody. All right, so let's go for this. Oh, oh. I love it when it does that, you know, because it looks, I don't know, all inky. Let's get some onto there, and I'm going to get some onto there anyway. <laughs> I'm going to get some onto there so we've got some colour. Oh. Oh, so I got powder on it. That looks like it's got powder on it, so that's a waste. Never mind, let's have a look. Let's try this. I'm going to try this on its own, actually. I've used loads of this because it just wastes it. Oh, there we go. Oh, such fun. See, that's the colour it comes up, and it's all over there, look. Oh. See, I put too, too, put too much on. That's what it is. I've realised. Put too much on. Put it on the pinch, so you're wasting a lot of money there. So it's definitely a good idea for these, these brush ones. Which of these, you've got a little hole in the top, even though I haven't got a pin yet. Unless I can find those pins of 20 years ago. Right, so I'm not gonna, that's not dark enough for me. I'm going to put other colours on there. Ooh, it's such fun. Right, so there we go. That's crimson. See how dark that looks? Oh, it's coming up a lot because it's still it's wet already a bit. Let's get some scarlet as well. Brilliant red. What's brilliant red compared with scarlet, I wonder? Or compared with crimson? Is it the same? I don't think so. But look, you don't need much. Oh, 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 oh look. Oh, can you see that? What's the difference? There's not much difference. I think I'm going to put some purple in there actually as well. Purpley, where are you, dear? There it is. Oh, look, it, it came when I called. I don't know whether it has been phone in the doctors again because. <sighs> oh, Canary looks like he is. Right. Yeah, a good thing about this as well, using um, because I'm doing it as because when I do voiceovers, I can't, I'm not, I don't know how to remove the coffin. <laughs> At least this way I can. But I do feel better, it's just my asthma is so bad. Right. Oh, no, this isn't working. Where's my thing? Yeah, I think that's why you need to keep the pins in if you have any. <laughs> right, in yellow. I'll accept. Yeah, I had a bit of an interruption there because fact, actually got the doctor actually rang me. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so I've got to go in this afternoon. Right then, so what we were doing now, that's that is actually very powdery. So that purple, no, it's the purple from that's brush purple, isn't it? I love the way it does it. So I've got um Ooh, emerald. Let's have a look. See if we've got any more. Oh, dark brown. Let's have some dark brown on it. Let's have some dark brown up there. And I'm going to mix some. Uh, let's have some bits. I'm going to mix something else in there. Let's have a look. Well, I love sea green, but I think sea green's in there. Crimson, brilliant red. Ultramarine. Not had an ultramarine yet. That's a dark blue. Yeah, you see, you put little bits in. See, it just comes out nicely. Don't you have to put big loads of pinches of it in there. <clears throat> Right, you'll see later what I'm going to do. Right. Um, I want to try some more colours. Leaf green. That's that weird stuff. Into I like that one. Cobalt blue. Let's put that in there. I can see that really comes. Ooh. Right, let's put some more on. I want it quite dark in places. That's a lot of brown, isn't it? Oh. Let's try and get that off. Ooh, 
Oh, is that actually coming out? I can't even tell. All right, let's put this on. Ooh, that's what I know what we could have here. Let's have some pinkish crimson. That'll do, won't it, or something. So I'm putting that on as well when the page is wet. Can do both. Brilliant. Oh, look. Oh, look at that colour there. Ooh, brilliant. Brilliant red. Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> right, let's see if we can get any more. So there must be some more powder on there because it's coming up, isn't it? Ooh, that makes it a lot better. So... One thing is I notice my hearing's really bad. <laughs> I can't hear what people are saying. So if you're speaking to me, speak up. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> right, so I'm going to let those dry. I've never got two, haven't I? So that'll be enough, actually, for what I want. See, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Oh. Turn it over. Let's have some colour on the page. <laughs> Yay, have I got some nice colour? yeah right then so that's like a mass so let's have a look at the other one we did and that's that one did i do two like oh, i did two like that didn't i i thought i was gonna do oh that one's oh i'm gonna try something else with this one anyway that's the one i was gonna try the other thing with hmm, i don't know though i might even do look that was nearly dry actually that is actually nearly that's probably because it's such thin paper Oh, we could do it now, couldn't we? Right, then. There's two things I was going to do. I can't really show you because it looks terrible because I've done it upside down. <laughs> but I've got... I've got these. I've got these recently. I know I'd wanted them for some reason. And the black and white ones. I've got loads of black and white ones, actually. <laughs> But I was using some colour ones as well. But it wasn't it wasn't that one. It was the other one I was gonna do with this. Um that's actually wet underneath. Is it? Oh it's there, there's the wet. Let's put some on there. <laughs> right, so what I was going to do is make shapes like this and cut them out and decorate a page. Um, you know what I'm like with leaves and things and flowers. Right, I'll show you how to draw a simple flower. All you've got to do is circle. I'm doing, I would, these pens are Uniposca. I would say they are um, acrylics, but these are really thin. That's the PC1M. I like that. That's my favourite one because it's nice and big. The PC1MR is a too thin for me. I like this one. It does a 0.7mm line, which is good. Well, I can do this. is actually because I've done it twice. It looks bigger. But anyway, what I do is when you draw a flower, do a top like that it's basically like a you do i do five petals usually do like two i know a head two arms and, and two legs and you've got your flower okay now you can mess about doing things like that and that's a green flower as well yeah if you've been with me all my for ages you know you know about my green flowers there we go another one i'll do it on the pink can you see what i'm doing i can't even tell there's the head there's an arm. Let's see if that, petals aren't a regular shape, so don't worry about that. There are all sorts of shapes. It's got a bit squashed somewhere along the line by the looks of it. And you can do things like dots in the middle. <coughs> things like that as well. So that, see, and then head, arm, legs. That's how you do it. A five petal flower. There we go. Yeah, that'll be cute. So you just draw those nice green one again. And arms, legs. So that's had to be a bit longer because obviously I had to fit it in. <laughs> right, there we go. So don't worry about that, that's fine. Yay, there, right. So now you can do things like on the green side, this is why I've done it green and that coloured. I'm going to do some leaves because it's spring. It's not all you can do when in autumn. You could do all sorts of pretty stuff, couldn't you? With this, and I'm also going to use. Don't have to just use 
I'm going to use black, you can use colours obviously, but I'm using the background as colours. I'm using that as well, I've done that, and I'll show you what I've done. Oh, and where is it? The original. There you start, and start cutting them out as well. So, so I'm going to do this now, I might do it fast mode, fast mode. I don't know whether I'm going to do a voiceover because I might do just music quickly. So I'm going to do this quickly, so you can either skip over it, or, and then go to the end. Where I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with these. I don't even know yet, but these are the things. Okay, see you soon. Welcome back to the mess. <laughs> right, what I've done is I've cut out a pocket for four inches by three inches. Cut. Obviously done the notch and the um, well the corners, and I've cut out a load of these. And I was thinking about I was thinking about decorating the pocket with them, which you can do. Um, you don't have to do that at all. Just like that. So, so let's have a look. So I'm going to put some leaves on first. I'm doing leaves on flowers. I was thinking you could also do a complete collage of flowers. I think that would look nice. Look at that. It's got that. Look, I've even got my blue cloth handy. There we go. Let's get a white one for the other side. Let's see. So I could put this on fast, I suppose. Just had an interruption. That these are right. Aren't they cute? Little heart-shaped paper clips. Oh, lovely. Hey, there we go. So, well, I've decided to mix up the <laughs> white. So, oh, should, that should have been black actually. Never mind. I don't know which one it should have been, but it should have been a black one. Never mind. That's fine. I oh, think it looks so cute. I could have hung them over and then either cut them off or like it is. I did go around it with some ink. Did I tell you that one? I did go around it with some ink earlier already I'll do it again do it again yeah there we go oh spring pocket yeah, so cute right what I'm going to do now is let's see the one dry Ooh, if the other one's dry we'll do it right oh before I do that I forgot to tell you about those hey so what I've done is it looks a lot better with this on it Ooh, oh dear that's gone over there somewhere don't wait when turn them over yeah, I have tried them with that. You can put these in as well, just to fill in a little, if you've got any gaps. I know, just, just cut out circles with a little tiny punch. Yay, yeah, there we go. So you cut, cut those in as well, just to decorate. See, that definitely looks like better with some edging. Definitely, oh dear. That's not the edging, that's middling. <laughs> Never mind. I've got a middling bit. Oh no, I've dropped my pen. 
it's okay i can get i can reach it in this when it's because this room's bit i don't know if you know this i did change the room round. i didn't actually i got a new desk on saturday my daughter got it got it me for nothing she says i love it back i love it when if i need it ever need it but I might not ever need it that's not right <laughs> she should give it to me but it's good it is a good desk but if not i can put my picnic table back up i suppose and i'll have it this way round rather than the other way round all right so let's put our middling one back in there yeah Ooh, oops that's got a queue it's like a queue ah. things like that just put that one on as well Right, so you can put them wherever you like. It looks like I've just drawn on that because I look the same as the background. <laughs> Never mind, I suppose you could do that as well. You could do a little bit of drawing on the there like that. The cute ones as well. I don't know, they look like pieces, I don't know, stones in the soil, I don't know. Or buds. There we go, do a few black ones. To keep in with the what I've already done. So I'm use both, haven't I? I think it looks nice with both. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Yes, I could have just done that, couldn't I? Instead of done a middling one. <laughs> middling. There we go. Oh, I'm showing. I'm showing the lights. The lights are here. I've got two lights. <laughs> oh, right. There we go. Oh, yeah, don't you think that looks pretty? Ooh, legs pretty. Yeah, it does don't turn. I'm just I'm back to the book page. That's my um, jelly gel press print. I love that. That's my favourite one. I've used it in, I almost was using this one. Yeah, oh, I've got a um, brusher on it. Never mind, let's carry on with the next thing. Okay, yay. <laughs> right, so I've got the other one back now. So what we're going to do on here, all different things you could do. Um, I would say, hmm, different colours. thinking about making pockets, but I don't know you could do. Pockets. Different ways of decorating them with uni poskas. Bad. Look. Da, 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 da. Think we all upside down. But you could do several, anything like this um, to decorate them. So what I'm doing is I'm let's do I perhaps do a short pocket. I might just use the type. Right. Let's have a short. Let's do a slip, little tiny. Oh, we could do a tuck, I suppose. Just do a little top. We'll do a, a tall plant like this. Then you just put circles on the end. Like that. So you're just drawing lines and circles there. You're not doing anything else. And then come down a bit more less a bit a bit less. There we go. And try not to touch the you know, like this. And then one more. Ooh, leg nod. And then we can make that little bit, she might the baby one. Daddy, mummy, baby, yay. <laughs> there we go. Uh, okay. Well, it's not that at this, we're not always that, are we, at this? Um, I can hear a noise, but I don't know what it was. I think it might be my husband's phone. Right. There we go, how about that? Wow, oh, that looks rather cute. Let's have a bit of white grass. Yay. You don't have to have white grass, you could have coloured grass. I've got my coloured ones there. Have pink grass if you want. I do like the black. In fact, let's have some black grass as well because I think that would, because I've got the black and the black and white. Oh, come on. That's the, the only trouble with these, if they, you have to, and then if you press them too much, they tend to flood. That's a bit of a knot. I've got, a, do you know, I've got a dangling in my face, a bit of kitchen roll with, um, with paint all over it. Well, busho. Uh, yeah, I think this one's probably one of the ones that's nearly running out. There we go. That looks nice, don't you? It looks nice. Just a few, we could do a couple more of the things in the mix, I suppose, like a couple of pretty crosses floating in the air, like seeds, seeds hanging about. 
drop some seeds seeds coming around there we go yeah so what you would do now is probably back it with probably <laughs> probably probably back back it with something we don't have to do it straight you can do it like that like i like to do so we do that let me just do that and i'll show you Right there. Right, so let's get this down. So we're gonna have a little cool attack. Yep. Oh, how about that for a little tuck? So you'd put that on your page, as in like that, wouldn't you? Yeah, and you could, oh, that looks nice on that brown. And you could tuck things in it. Tuck things in it. The pocket as well. Wow. Oh, I adore that, don't you? Oh, I do. It looks so cute. I'm going to have a go, I'm going to have a try with watercolours in a bit as well. And I'm going to, I'll show you right at the end. I won't bother to, because watercolours, you just do the similar thing. You, either, you can either make the page wet first. Or you can wet the page after, you know, just do it straight on with watercolours. Um, that's a bit different. Oh, wow. That looks so nice against that brown, I think. Oh, oh I'm a bit excited. No, 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 no. Right, shall we get the next one? Something else done now. I can't really see them. What are they? Oh, we're recording. Oh. Oh. Ah, wasn't recording. Ooh, there's me wondering if you could see and everything, and I want to even record it. But that's what I made up. <clears throat> um, where's my skizzerers? Not skizzerers, the other thing. The corner around her. I'm going to do a big one. Big, big, a big corner. Oh, yeah. It does it. There we go. And let's get some. Kits and things that's really nice, yeah. So, all I did was now this is um, what's named Joanna, ba Joanna Baseford style. Uh, a book's called uh, Inky Wonderland, um, something about Inky Wonderland. So, I have, I have mentioned it before. Right, so, all she does is a little circle, another little circle, another little circle, and another little circle. And you've got a little flower. Obviously, I, I, mine's diff I did mine different, and you do a huge leaf behind it like that and you join them together with some wooden woody woody bits little shaky bits if you like but mine are quite straight there yo who how about that <clears throat> so it's jo johanna basford how to i think something like how to draw in clear wonder how to draw in clear wonderlands that's how i learned how to do this And it's a very good book. And my pen is... Why did I choose this one? As I know it was already... Red. Well, it's not even got any ink left. There, there, there. Right, anyway, that, that. Oh, what we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? We got that one. We got that one. Yeah, you can do things like that. Let's see what else we could do. I don't know if you could do it. You could do all sorts of things, as I said. All sorts of patterns. Look, that's my Jonah Baseford one. Look, line, wavy lines and circles. Yay, a lot lines and circles at the end. Same as what we did on the thing. Trees and just, uh, what do you call it, shapes. To draw a leaf, right. All you've got to do to draw a leaf is, if you're not even, in, if you're not even confident in drawing a leaf, it's easy. Right, so you've got a branch there. A little thing there. And a little thing to join it there. And you can do that if you want. That's what I do. That's my little touch. I'm not sure if Joanna does that. I can't remember. <laughs> Whether I got it off there or not. <laughs> anyway, the leaf is like that. Just a little, not not around. Well, you can actually, you can do it as round as you like. Do it like that and it's fine. That's a leaf. But it's usually a little bit like an arc. Arc of a circle. Part of a circle. Another part of a circle. So it's basically circles and lines, isn't it? <laughs> and I've done things like this. Okay, leaves. Uh... I'll say leaves again, leaves just again like I showed you. 
a part of a circle, another part of a circle, and then see it's not even. But they look like you could tell the leaves because I've got the pattern. Look a bit like a bird's foot. <laughs> well, I'm you could put prints on, I suppose. Um, rubber stamp prints in black or something. So we can use anything like that. So I hope you've enjoyed it today. I really do because. But at the end, I'm going to I'm going to show you right at the end because I haven't done it yet. Watercolors. See what they see if they do the same thing. So if you haven't got any brushes, you could use watercolors. Okay, that's my. I love that. Don't you love that? Though? Oh, so pretty. So pretty. And then so is the soft, florally springy things, planty springy things. Yay. Right then. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay. Right. So that's your watercolor one. I noticed the colors are a lot more defined than they are. Um. With the brush shows, so they're, they're very mixed, aren't they? With the brush shows, let's have a look at this one. That's the one I did with I sprayed water on the page and then I took it off with some napkin and I took the color off with some napkin. I mean, that I put on there, and it took all the colors off. So I tried to just put dots of color, but I thought I'm gonna be there ages doing that. So what I did was, although with watercolors, you're supposed to use less, really, I put it on quite thick and then spattered paint and then. I came along with this. I, w I went ahead and kind of go ahead. <laughs> right, there we go. Now that Americans say, go ahead. Right, there we go. So, there we go. Just like that. And then just made patterns on the paper, which helped mix the colours. But so you can still see that's a little bit wet. I think I do prefer the brush out to do what I did today. If you compare the brush out. Way around, that's the proper way around. Definitely prefer. I mean, that I do like this this effect here the blue and the purple. I like that. I do think those are a bit plainer. Well, you've got all sorts of colours in this one, depends what you want, really. It's getting drier now. I might have a quick look. I can, I don't even like them, I want I've got loads of whites, what am I talking about? I've got, I've got a pack of 12 of these. Just checking it, mm, is it working? Because it's a bit... Right, let's have a look. Mm. Might be still a bit wet. That might be too wet for it. It's either too wet or it doesn't work on watercolour. Just a minute, let's see if that's a bit dry down the bottom. Oh, it might be the pen. Wait a minute. Let's get that on. That looks better. Yep, still the same lot. You can still make those pretty patterns. Yeah, so you can still do your. Oh dear, that's still wet. <laughs> you can still do your patterns. Brilliant. <laughs> That's a brand new one, I don't use that one. Okay. Oh, I've got a new one of these, but hold on. Now, so I got my new one out. Yeah, you can see that's fine. So obviously just the white pens are a bit a bit old perhaps. There we go. Oh, it's got a little, it's got a little face on it, that little flower. But I didn't mean to. It's got two eyes and a, an open mouth. Right. It's like a baby. Oh, that's a Joanna Baseford type flower. That is, isn't it? Uh -huh. Right. There we go. Yeah. There and get carried away, yay! Right, yeah, yeah, that works. If, if you haven't got any brushes and you want to have a go at this, you can use watercolors. But you just need to, if you want some mixes, 
Uh, salt doesn't have, have an effect. You've got some sort of like thick rock salt. If you put it on wet watercolour paper, I think it sort of like leaves like little watermark sort of thing. Probably a bit like that. Should have done that, shouldn't I? Never mind. Put a bit of salt on it. Just put some salt on the corner. See what if you like the effect. Then use it again. <laughs> if you do, I think um, that quick thick salt. You know that um, sort of rock salt. Okay then. I hope you'll enjoy my little content today. Um, please subscribe to my channel. Please give me a thumbs up. Yay! Please share my video. Press the notification bell with your crafty fingers. And join my Facebook group, Hazy Crazy Arts. I am I am doing a series on there of backwater colours. I've done washes so far. So there's one video on there um, of washes. I thought that might be a bit... People was asking for it, so I did it on my channel. Especially for channel. I did it on my, on my Facebook group, especially for that, for those people. I've got to get ready now to go to the doctors about my chest. Might be a chest infection. Or it might be just severe asthma. And we'll see. I'll let you know, okay. Bye then, thanks very much, and goodbye, and everybody please take care.